Hi CBC Music, this is Bela Fleck and I'm going to be showing you some of the methods that I use to do my own version of three finger style banjo. Hope you enjoy. I play a three finger style banjo which means I wear three picks. A plastic thumb pick, even though this one has the metal on it, and two metal finger picks. And the cool thing that happens when you start rotating those three surfaces over the five strings of the banjo is you get the, a very fast, um, effortless sound. I'll just give you an idea of the sound that you get without even using the left hand. I will say one of the really important things about this style of banjo is you alternate your fingers. You never use the same finger twice in a row, so one of the key things just keep alternating. With the left hand, you can do things, a million things, in fact. But you start out with the open strings, and you start out with slides and hammer-ons. A slide is when you press down the string, and then you move your finger while keeping the finger down. So Earl Scruggs is the guy that started this style, really. And he did a lot of things with slides that sounded like this. Now, if he didn't do the slide, it would sound like this. But he's doing it with a slide. A pull-off sounds like this. Pull-off can either be to an open string where you go and take a closed string and pull it to an open, or you can start with a finger, a higher finger, and pull to a lower finger. I think of the three finger picks almost more as they were as if they were a flat pick. And that means actually sticking to one string for a little while and going back and forth between the thumb and the index finger as, as if the downstroke of a flat pick and an upstroke of a flat pick, dang, 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 dang. instead we go down, we go thumb, index, thumb, index, thumb, index, and it sounds like this. The key is to start with the open strings and just do simple things like three notes, two close and two open, like Slow that down way slow for you, just so you can get a, have a chance of figuring out. The tricky thing with that style is not making a clicking sound every time you hit with these metal picks on these metal strings. And that is something that we call playing through the string. Playing through the string is, means we don't sit our pick on the string and then pluck it, because you'll hear there's a little click when you just sit your finger on the string. But if you play from a distance, you don't hear a click. So, one nice thing to do to, to prepare for this is to just play on the open string, like four notes at a time. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Once you can get those two notes clear, then you can start adding the left hand. So we can start with, we'll try this one. One, two, three, four. Instead of going, we go, uh, eventually you can be playing all up and down the neck like this. 